Yeah, I, I'm, a, I'm a little worried about this. Uh, I have tried this character. But it never went well. And even though I've tried it several times, I have zero completion marks. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, now, I, I have changed something. I'm gonna start off with taking item moves, by the way. I have changed something. Uh, I remember it feeling pretty awkward to hit Q all the time. While, like, moving around. That... I have bound. I have double bound the uh, use card key. I have it on numpad zero as well as Q. You can actually do that in the options. You don't need like some program for that. It does let you bind two keys, so that makes it easier to actually use him offensively and not die at the same time. That was good. By the way, that's kind of interesting. I got charged uh, key and big charge battery. <laughs> I don't know what that thing is called, so I'm just calling it big charge battery. Repent. So I think I'm actually going to go for the beast first. At least I'm going to try to. Because I would like to unlock Esau Jr. Just to... Have him in the item... Uh, the uh, the uh, item room pool thing. Words. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be kind of hard to talk while playing this, because this character is very... Very much demands your attention, because if you don't know, by the way, if you get hit by once by this asshole, you become the lost, and then you can't take damage, otherwise you die. What items especially good on Jacob? I don't know. Hey, <clears throat> hey, Vaxon. Ups. I know not leaf works, but I kind of don't want to do that. Maybe if I get not leaf, I'll try it. Golden pill, really? Okay, let's try it. <laughs> I don't know what really just happened, but all right. Awesome. Glad I took the pills. <laughs> I think I got a tears up. At least retrovision actually looks kind of cool now rather than just be annoying. Previously it was just like blurry. But yeah, this is arguably the hardest character in the game. And uh, it's the last character, and I have to do literally everything. No problem. Good start, though. Do I want to use this now? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, old retrovision kind of made my head hurt. I'm wondering how just how long this is gonna take. Part of me says like it won't take that long, but the other part of me is like, nah, it'll take like a hundred tries. I read it all. Yeah, he spawns like 30 seconds after you enter this floor. And uh, yeah, he will never go away.
This guy is going to be chasing us for the whole game. You can't use him offensively like that. I've got this Anima Sola in the bottom right that I can use to shackle him. And if I use it again, I can unshackle him and he will always instantly charge when he unshackles. Uh, okay, I can take both, but I don't even want the other item. Uh, getting hit by him is really bad. I, I will get hit by him on purpose at some points in the run, though. Uh, Habit is pretty great here. Okay, we already got like a really good run. But with this character, your run is never really set. If you get hit, hit by this guy once, your run is in extreme danger. Because you turn into the lost and then you die in one hit. kind of poor. I tried to shackle him right on top of the boss. So he would do constant damage. Nine lives, huh? That's actually really interesting. Take this. And I'll take this. I did reduce my hard containers. Okay. Now he does not go away if you're lost. He'll still chase you. Computer on, do you still get the unlocks for the char? Yeah. You can also shackle other enemies. If uh, the dude is not up. It's gonna be hard to see where I am, and then I'm just gonna get hit by Isa. So I'm pretty sure like nine lives is like incredible for this, because even if I die to Isa, I'm just gonna respawn. And nine lives is also like perfect for the beast fights. And I was gonna go beast anyway, so let's try and make this work. This might, this might be really good. Yeah, I think normally I would take the guillotine here, but not as a character. No, you can't kill Esau anymore. You can't shoot, shoot middle. Which I think is a good change, because, like, one, being able to kill him made so many, like, weird cheeses. And also, it kind of went against, like, the spirit of the character, I feel like. And towards the end of the game, you would just accidentally kill him, like, all the time. Okay. 
Are you gonna charge? I could uh, mess with this guy a bit. I kind of want to try and get boss stretch done as well. Uh, do I? I kind of want to focus on beast actually. Oops, shouldn't have done that. Satanic Battle pretty great on this character. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Hello, Book of Revelations. I'd rather have the Satanic Bible though. Yeah, Spike Rocks would also kill him pretty much instantly. And killing him is not really a good idea. Because you still turn into the Lost. With no mantle, I should say. Don't scap, man. I do know what the birthright does for this character. <laughs> I want to try it. <laughs> I, I, I do want to try it. The birthright for this character is hilarious. That was dangerous. <laughs> I thought you liked it there. Um, hmm. Hmm. Let me think about that. What does it do? It spawns another Esau. What was the card I had? Hermit. Should take easy clubs. So there's two of them chasing after you. Okay, this is dangerous. All right, mouse scary. You can run through him when, when he's shackled. Some people don't know that. Out. Please. <laughs> Fucking imps, man. I think I might just do this and get rid of the heart container. I think I'm gonna skip Bob's brain. So we could do boss rush here. I I, hmm. I kind of just want to focus on beasts though. 
basically, boss rush gives me a lot of time to potentially get hit by Esau and then ruin the whole run. If I can get to the beast fights with nine lives, all nine lives, then I'm pretty sure I'm set. Well, sort of. His run is not amazing, though. Hate this room. Could use the speed up. Sure, is nickel there? Uh, let's see if I care. Uh, sir. Okay. Weird. Boss rush tomato? True. I should probably just try it. What, what do you guys think? It's not like this run is like a one in a million or anything. It's just a good run. Ooh, spicy. <laughs> Indeed, evil. I mean, first I have to actually make it to boss rush. There's no guarantee. My run really isn't that strong. It just seems strong because Esau destroys everything. I don't know, given that this run is not that strong, I kind of don't want to do it. Ooh. Very spicy. Okay, that's fine. looking for whatever could get a card but can also just not <laughs> that was risky I should use the Amasola defensively as well. It shouldn't just be an offense thing. And I don't need to use it to like use it defensively or be offensive either. It's possible to guide him into it without even using. I think. Oh, I didn't use the th thing on this floor. Oops. Well, we got a box instead. Ooh. Well, that's really good. No, 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 no. Don't, don't hit me. A box. Ooh, trinket is good. I don't think we're making bosses. Oh, scary. Chariot is cool. But I'm just going to take Ace of Clubs. Thought for sure I'd get, get hit there. I decided to get hit by the boss instead because, you know, that doesn't, like, murder me instantly. It just does some damage. 
As you see, once I get a Devil Deal, I'm getting hit on, on purpose to turn into the last, so I can get the Devil Deals for free. This character is very intense. I think it's a fitting character to leave for last. As well. Either this or Tainted Lost would have been like a good fit as the last one. Excuse me, I, I need that card. Yeah, we're not making busters. Oh no! <laughs> the joke is that I didn't even want to make busters, if I'm being honest. Probably just gonna bomb myself a lot trying to dodge this guy. It's good for the beast fight. I mean, not really. It's okay for the beast fight. Tomato pretty clutch there. This guy is kind of an asshole. That's Saint Jacob. I do have the full card, so let's just go. Hmm. Was hoping it would spawn on the left there. It did, eventually. Do I take the Polaroid or do I take. Wait, that doesn't matter. I'm, I'm gonna get rid of it anyway. Uh. Don't hit me again. Oh, Jesus. Where's my card? Hello. How's it going, buddy? Okay. Getting pretty tense. Man, being scared at this point in the run, that's how you know you're playing a, a tough character. Also, Curse of Darkness, huh? So I don't want to fuck around with this floor at all. As soon as I see the boss, I'm going. Uh, I'm not going to drop a trinket for the inner child, because I've already got 100 lives. And I would like to keep this trinket. Or maybe I should. Honestly, I kind of want to spawn Issa over here. Okay, there we go. Just so I have like a... I know where he is all the time. He does glow in Curse of Darkness. That's good. I won't be upset if I lose this run, but this is... Uh, my first time playing as him in ages. And, uh, you know, this is pretty hard. It's a good run, though. The Ascent should be pretty easy, because I think most of the time he won't even have time to spawn on the floor. Or he'll spawn near the end of the floor. I think I might start using Anima Sola more defensively rather than offensively now. Good move. 
Yeah, I like this song. When Rebirth first released, I was like not too terribly impressed with the music. But in Repentance, all the songs are like bangers. I mean, they weren't bad. It's not, it's, it's not like I dislike the music in Re Rebirth. I, I did pref prefer original Flash music though, when Rebirth released. Itch. Oh, that, that, that was the end of that room. I'm just gonna take this. Probably not worth it, but... I was gonna wait until the next floor to see what the other end was. Give me the fanny pack. I kind of want these batteries. Hmm, whatever. I know you're supposed to step on the buttons, but... This is what I'm doing, apparently. You can skip fighting this room by just pressing buttons, but also I'm um, scared, so you know. That's how I did that. That's fine. I feel like HP is really important in this character, just so you can like take hits. Do I drop the trinket? I don't really want to. No, nah, I don't want to. I spent it. It's gone. Just get over it. <laughs> now, please. How can you have spent our savings? <laughs> uh. Okay, I should probably speed run these floors as much as possible, so that Mr. Asshole Douchebag won't have time to spawn. Only come out of lurking for the best comments. I, I expect no less from you, to be honest. <laughs> These floors just do get longer the further up you go. I feel like that spawned a bit early. Not sure though. As soon as I encounter a tough room, I should use my card. Shut up! Shut up. Just keep me like this. I'm Good. We'll I enjoyed this dialogue the first time through. Uh, after that, it kind of, kind of like, whatever. <laughs> high Priestess? No, 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 no. Reverse High Priestess is a big no. Afraid of the foot? Uh, yeah, actually. <laughs> right, these assholes. Let them do things. Kind of waiting for the basement before I use this card. Because the basement has, like, some pretty nasty rooms. Caves do as well. Ah. 
The tainted enemies will always die to a bomb, by the way. Hmm, Bob's Brain. I could take it now. I kind of want to. It's a little scary. But I think I want to take it. I'm, I'm, I'm taking it. Maybe I should just save that. You need, to you need, to your need to be more willing with you using my card, honestly. I'm kind of doing good, too good to use Syndrome right now. No guillotine. Not on this character. <laughs> Pretty much any other character would probably try it. Not on this one though. I, I want to wait for him to spawn, so just so I know where he is. Whoa! He came zooming. I think he was actually going for the uh, these guys because they were affected by tomato, maybe. I don't know, that, that was weird. I don't really want to go in the small room. Fuck. So much for that, I guess. Oh, this room is scary. I want to make him charge a different direction and then go in. Okay, that's fine. I'll be honest, I don't really care about the chest. Okay, basement. Any room that seems tough, use it. Card, I mean. Okay, it's not gonna uh, get rid of Mega Fighter though, so no reason to use it here. Yeah, he he's like going for the Rotten Tomato dudes. Ugh, don't like that. Makes him more unpredictable. No, this, this room is fine. Didn't have uh, the Anima Sola selected there. Okay, final floor. You know what? Fuck this guy. Pretty nervous. Oh, that almost knocked me into the dude. Oh, 
Oh, almost happened again. I don't think I'm gonna get another charge on my book before we find the exit. So I'm gonna hold on to it and then maybe use the blessed penny to get a half sword. Okay. My hands are sweaty. I kind of don't care about the uh, conquest thing, so I think I might just stick with this in case it somehow helps with like fanny pack or something. Okay, I think I speedrun the home floor just to get dogma fights started as soon as possible. Oh, the bombs are good, though. Do I want him to spawn before Dogma? <laughs> Let's at least go to bed first. Just don't fucking get hit by Esau. If you gotta hit, get hit by the dude, that's fine. Or the boss, I mean. And that's totally fine. Just don't get hit by the fucking angry man. Can you stop spamming this attack? Actually, this one is even worse. Oh. Oh, the TV does contact damage. I didn't even know that. He doesn't one-shot, but it turns me into the Lost, which is kind of a one-shot. Lost with no mantle, that is. I really don't want Dunscaf right now. I really don't care too much about taking damage. I care a little bit, because, you know... I'm worried about where Esau's gonna spawn in the beast fight here. I'm still moving just in case it's like moving after me right now. Where is he at? Okay, he's right there. Okay, it still works the same way. Famine pushed him around. Don't like that. Charge, please. I'm gonna use Anima Sola 100% defensively. <sighs> yeah, I don't think I can lose this with the... Uh Nine lives, but it's still nerve wracking. Yeah. 
I might lose it if I... Okay, if I E saw early and then lose like all my soul hearts. And then just spirals. Okay, Bob's Brain is really weird in this fight. I kind of regret taking it because I didn't know it was going to ever work this way. Okay. Nine lives, pucks lost. Yeah, like, Bob's Brain is affected by gravity. That's weird. I, I don't see why it wouldn't. But I guess that's a valid concern. To be honest, I'm kind of mostly worried about the fucking gates on the beast and this attack, to be honest. Honestly, just hit me. Let's see if I care. Really glad I got nine lives. Holy crap. Otherwise, I'd be very nervous right now. This attack is also scary. Bob Spain is having some issues. Okay. Pretty sure I got this. Oh, interesting. He is not able to catch up. I'm also getting hit by everything, so... This is not how I thought this would interact. Probably gonna get hit a lot, a lot here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's fine. Where you at? I mean, there's no way I lose, but like, I'm st this is still nerve-wracking. Fine. Oh. First try, I think. The sky above cracked open, and a white beam of light reached down into oh. smiting the mother of harlots asunder. I think that was first try. As the beast descended down into the lake of fire, Isaac ascended towards the crack in the sky. Well, that's pretty common as boozing. He could see echoes of his past before him. He saw his mother mourning the loss of her son. He saw his father leaving them without turning to say goodbye. He saw his mother sleeping. I guess I'll watch this one on. He heard the late night fights they had that kept him up at night, and the guilt he felt for what he believed. Thank you for the GG's. Causing. He felt the pain in his stomach during those sleepless nights, and saw his shadow in the closet. So it turns out, Satan, Satan the Bible is pretty good, as well as Nine Lives. His shame, his worry. Nine Lives didn't turn out relevant, but it kind of did, because if I didn't have Nine Lives, I'll be way more nervous there. <laughs> Let me tell you. One true companion, alive and well. He saw his mother and father together again, holding each other. He felt his mother kissing him on the head after he had said his prayers, and the comfort in knowing someone was watching over him. He saw his own birth, and the faces of his parents filled with joy and optimism. And then he saw nothing. Are you sure this is how you want this story to end, Isaac? So I'm pr pretty sure this cutscene is not actually like how it goes in the story. I'm pretty sure that th this is what Isaac sees during his delirium. Happy ending? Okay, Daddy. Good. Are you getting sleepy yet? That's my speculation, anyway. Okay, so... <clears throat> Isaac and his parents lived in a small house on the farm. Okay. 
He's our junior. That's the last item unlocked besides, well, the obvious one, the certificate. 629. Yeah, that was uh, first try. Because I remember I have 239 two, or 293 deaths before this. Oh! Nice. Poggy, woggy, etc. Good shit. Win streak too. <laughs> Alright, well that's pretty dope. It does die anyway. Excuse me. This is fine. Sir. Sir. Try and focus on going fast for like bosses and shit. I'm still wondering if I should skip item rooms. Or the, f I mean, the first one. Just so I have a, like a planetarium chance so I can get my planetarium items in my collection. Should we seek a room? That's actually a duplicate pill, so I should use that. Good. Whoa! You charged sooner than I expected. Okay. First time I became the lost by accident. Right, it's blue famine, so he charges a lot. Well, rip these soul hearts. Pretty sure I can't take them when I'm uh, the lost here. Wait, I can't take them? I'm pretty sure that was not the case before. Okay, well, I just left two soul hearts for no reason. Good to know. All the water's pretty good. That was a secret room, really? Didn't expect that. Yeah, that was dumb. I <laughs> can't believe I made holy water decent. He 
he still doesn't like me. Wow, I ran into that, but the cube meat saved me. If I get hit one once by anything right now, we're toast. Except for Stonies, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, I th think the lower is like uh, Jacob stole Esau's birthright or something. It's in the Bible somewhere or something. Turn hard. Okay, okay, thank you, Cube Meat. <laughs> Brought Bobby. Probably shouldn't have taken that for like angel. But okay, I got it now. Um, I kind of want to focus on boss rush. So I'm not gonna do alt path here. But also, I, I want to get devils for the, the chance of getting a berserk. That's another item I need from my collection. You might wonder why I don't just play as Tainted King to get the collection done. Uh, I just don't want to, basically. I should have used Amasola there defensively. Let's do this right away. This is dangerous, yeah. Maybe the best bomb I've ever placed in my life. Really? I get that item. Um, weird. I don't think I want that. Because I can just take uh, devil deals for free anyway. But this next room scares me a bit. Okay, that's fine. Well, would love to get in there. Like I hang my in car or something. Liberty Camp is alright, but I think I would rather have the uh, kind of a penny. Whoa. Tip items we can stock up my shop items, true. This item is good, but it kind of the visual effect is kind of disturbing, I find. That's fine, I guess. Get 
this. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna ignore that. That thing makes it so shop items cost health and devil items cost money. It's kind of bad. I kind of wish I had those two soul hearts from the first floor. <laughs> oh well. One plus one free. Oh god. Hey, soul heart. Probably should have waited with picking that up. Especially because it's cursed from what, whatever. My devil room chance is already fucked anyway. Excuse me, sir. Right, I forgot the made it so humbling bundle isn't guaranteed to double. Totally forgot with that. Oh. Skirt. You can run through Esau when he's shackled. This room is kind of horrible for this character, by the way. Get me out of there. Very limited space. You don't want to be stuck in a, like a straight line. Probably not making boss rush on this one. It's fine. We got plenty of runs where we can make it. This run is, run is pretty weak. But even the weak runs of this character are still good because... Um, yeah, I think I would like that. Because Esau is very dangerous. Right, and I also need to do... Um, a mega stand, so we need, we need to do Angel. At some point. So I really shouldn't have taken Brother Bobby. scary. So I have uh, bound the uh, anima solo to a second button because the default button Q is fine but when you're moving with WSD and hitting Q all the time it makes it kind of hard to move sometimes. So I've, I have a bound to numpad zero as well. Kind of an asshole. He does die very fast, though. Assuming he doesn't shield all the time. Coin purse. Okay, well, you you gotta get. Got, <laughs> can I talk? You gotta take the horse pill. Horse pills are fun. Except when they're not, I guess.
Might even want to wait for Ezot to spawn at the start. Because I'm very weak without him. Slam that right now. Probably not making boss rush. Probably don't even want to make boss rush. Because I'm pretty weak here. Okay. So I finally re realized the difference between Play Doh Cookie and like 3 Doh Bill. <laughs> Took me long enough. The three dollar bill is random tier effects, whereas Play Doh Cookie is random status effects. I was like, aren't these the same item? Oh, nice. I don't knock you hit there. <laughs> oh. Tough room. Okay. I'm apparently the decent only enemy in the game. There we go. I had to mute for a bit. Hey, Sammy. Thank you so much for the resub there. How's it going? 65 months. Many months. I finally went ahead and got the uh, drive, by the way. Sorry it took so long. Thanks again for that, by the way. Yeah, I, I just had a win against the beast on this character. I haven't actually got it set up yet because I'm fucking. Yeah. I just got it, so, you know. It's not like I've had it for like weeks. Could make boss rush here.
These items are uh, not too helpful. I'm actually going to get notch stacks here. <laughs> it's very rare that I pick this up because usually I have something else. Or uh, I don't have the money. Alright, well that's a problem. I guess we're not doing boss rush. I'll be amazed if I make it out of this floor. Okay, well, <laughs> notch stacks didn't last too long. Actually, I could, uh, Bible here. I guess Mon. And then come back for the Satanic Bible. I'll hold Satanic Bible for now. And then we'll Bible Mon. Assuming I live that long. Which is not too likely, to be honest. Reasonably likely. Yeah, just don't get it. Adam Solo is pretty good. We'll get it unlocked after doing Delirium on this character as well. For all other characters. Now, you won't have Esau chasing you on the other characters, but at least you can use it against bosses and shit. Which is actually really good, because the match is sh such a short cooldown. Uh, you're basically just stunning bosses of, like, ages. Good. Kind of surprised that's the first time I died. Well, let's go for Brook here. <laughs> Spider's worst addition to the game. That was surprisingly good uh, animal soul there. Sure, we'll do now. The haunt. <laughs> awesome. Okay, I went surprising the ball actually. Yeah, double ghost is impossible. I think I'm gonna start skipping the first item room. I don't know. I, I need two planetarium items. So I think I've played this sacrifice room three times. That's a lot of money. What the fuck? Five. Six. 
six. Oh, don't die, by the way. <laughs> I almost stepped on it again. <laughs> That would have been a really funny way to die. Golden Heart. Yeah, but I didn't expect to give him that much money. A little delirious. I think that was seven. So, like... It's like no benefit to do anymore. Because next one is going to be Troll Bombs, and then, then it's going to be Uriel. Okay, I guess I bought that. I kind of want the Strength card. But... I'll take the strength card. Yeah, I'm not 100% sure how I feel about little Dorian. It can definitely be dangerous. Really good work there, though, with the little chub. I got this active item, should probably use it, huh? Well... Not, not so great. Converter is interesting. Might take it. Was it nerfed? I wouldn't say that's a nerf, that's just a bug fix. On cool. Oh, okay. You mean like that. Can you. <laughs> Fucking troll pop. Oh yeah, spider butt gives uh, spiders now. I think I'm actually gonna stay with this. Oh, it only does it if enemies are killed by it. Okay, his paw. Need a bomb. <laughs> okay, well, BBF was pretty sick there. Yeah, let's go for angels, maybe get this mega stamp. These items, though. Could really use a bomb right now. Maybe there's one in the shop.
Hey, it's my bomb. <laughs> Just in time. <laughs> Tainted rock. Jesus. Okay, <laughs> that was pretty good. Best spider butt ever. Where you at, buddy? Come on. <laughs> Tough room though. I hit nothing. I'm actually kind of digging a little delirious right now. Nice. Good stuff. Wow, those explode really fast. Bye, 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 bye. Uh, yeah, I'll take duality. Said, give me that. That one, uh, I forgot what that is. I used to know these. <laughs> Come on, bro. There we go. Worth, honestly. Oh, uh, tech two. Tech 2 is actually good now, so yeah. Okay, pretty decent right now. Oh yeah, that's what it does. Oof, spicy. my soul heart. <laughs> How great this room. Oh, right, you're there. Hello. <laughs> uh -uh. 
Yeah, this is more how I, how I expected these runs to go, if I'm being honest. Kinda can't believe I first tried the beast. Yeah, I totally forgot about Esau there for a second. <laughs> I don't recommend forgetting about him. I believe uh, he's mad because in the Bible or something, Jacob sold Esau's birthright for like food. Excuse me, di dip. I'm gonna die. Dangle. Dingle, please. Really? Fuck it. Okay. Pretty good. Don't like the speed down. Oh yeah, the, the soup. That's why red stew is an item. Oh right, that's how that works. Leo, uh, really? Fine. This is fine. <laughs> yeah. Would have been funny if they spawned a spider and killed me there. What's left to do? A lot. <laughs> Everything but beasts. <laughs> What's left to do? Yes, pretty much. Oh, nice. Good shit. Another crane game. Fucking little monsters, man. Probably shouldn't be messing around with those. I guess I can do this and probably kill everything. Yeah. Should probably search for crawl spaces. But also, like, nah. That was close. Okay, well. <laughs> See, this is how I expected these runs to go. <laughs> oh, man. I got in spawning spiders there. Oh, Penny. Okay, that guy just charged right into me. A little rude. Got Dingle and then Dangle. Dingle, Dangle. Is 
Excuse me. I'm gonna die to Dangle. <laughs> okay. I just got one in a hundred chance. Easy. Did I go to the shop? No. I like to just question mark when I got that. <laughs> uh, nope. Speed up as well. Abaddon is very hard to use because like the ring is so small and like tracks behind you. It charges really fast though. It's good when you're running away from enemies that are chasing you. Alright, well that was weird. I think if you also use spin down dice on little Abaddon, it turns into death certificate. Wait, no, it's C-section. I don't know. Maybe I'm just making shit up. I remember people trying to get C-section when it was unimplemented and like spin down dice little Abaddon was like one of the ways to do it or something. Card. Hey, Ian's blessing. That's cool. Yeah, I didn't do anything. It just didn't work at all. Okay, mushrooms. Watch out for those, because I've got Leo. This is this is not good. Actually, that was totally fine. <laughs> right. Oh. Help. I already got the item room. We can get bosses. So many synergies. I've only had it like once. And it was like at the end of a run or something. Or it was like tainted eaten or something. And it just instantly disappeared. I don't remember. Dama, kind of don't, not a huge fan of that item. Probably shouldn't be trying this one, this guy is after me. But also, you can't stop me. Well. <laughs> it's an active item, I guess.
kind of hard to use little Abdon and uh, try to damage with Esau at the same time. Oh, good. This is fine. Let me out. That was Sigil Buffman. If I saw that right. I'm pretty sure I did. Sigil Buffman is like the best trinket in the game. I don't love the idea of turning into Lost here, but can't stop me. Yeah, it's a drop Don't <laughs> step on the mushrooms, holy shit. I'm not even gonna grab that key because I'm scared. Straw is pretty good. I'll, I'll take straw. You like? I'm pretty sure Sigil Buffmet does protect you against Esau. Yeah, I probably shouldn't just stand there. But also, I didn't really know where to go. Strong run. That's fine. You saw Jinry? I have no idea. I barely even know how the item works. I did just unlock it, so... I, I, I do need it from my collection, obviously, because I just unlocked it. Help. <laughs> Golden penny. Um, I don't know if this item is like any good. I don't know. Just, I'm just gonna pretend I didn't see it. The item is neat, but like. Classic room. God, this room. Can you, like, go away? I think I do want mom's box. That seems pretty great. I guess I should use it. But I don't think I'm going to be switch switching trinkets anyway. kind of gotten to the point where trying to pay attention to little Abaddon is a little hard. So I'm kind of just not bothering. Whoa, okay. I didn't get hit somehow. <laughs> I 
Somehow I didn't get hit through all that. Hey, marbles! I could uh, potentially swallow the sigil. Okay, this is interesting. You could go down so that Empty Vessel actually works here. I think I'm just gonna take the portals though. I'll take the rift. Help. Curse of Darkness on the fucking boss rush floor, huh? Maybe we can get a sun card. Five minutes. I might turn up the gamma on this floor. Once I get to boss rush. I'll turn it back after. See shit, Captain. It's dank depth as well, which is uh, the darkest floor. Strength card. It's the uh, pretty much the best boss rush card you could ever get. Where is anything? I didn't go to item room. I almost ran into him. Weird. I think I might just ignore it. Need to pay attention to the timer. <laughs> Do a little loop-de-loop. -loop. Broken... that's a magic skin, basically. Um... Hmm. Was never worried. What do you mean? Ow. That was extra scary because I was on my cards. I had to switch off the card. Where's the fucking item room? At least Esau glows in Curse of Darkness. It would be pretty rude if it, he didn't. <laughs> All that track for that. I kind of want to take the Lover's card, but like, strength is too good. I think a lot, a lot of people don't know exactly how good strength is. It has the exact same effect as Magic Mush.
I'm gonna turn up the gamma here. Best accidental use ever. Uh, I'll take negative for damage. We're doing fine on time. Hello. Haven't fought you in a while. Nice. I actually kind of like Minecrafter, but not right now. <laughs> right, I can't fly. A lot of stuff is going on. Pretty good damage with the strength card. Stopwatch is making this pretty simple. I like the new sprites for champion bosses. This death sprite looks pretty badass. Is the heart still alive? No, okay. Oops. I'm actually profiting HP here. Things can go south real fast though with this character. Too much knockback. Strength card is definitely making this run stream stronger than it is. Not saying it's a bad run, definitely not. Which is not quite as strong as it seems right now. Let's go to Ragman because he's annoying. Guardian, Guardian Jr. Nice. Nice ESO snipe, thank you. <laughs> and then Guardian Queens. How fitting. How many Guardians though? Uh, answer yes. Oh, Gage's eyes are just glowing in the dark. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Dingle's back. <laughs> Was this the run where I nearly died to Dingle twice? Or did I die to Dingle? I don't remember. When you play this game for a long time, runs kind of just blend together.
I don't know if I've said this on stream, by the way, but I, I've, I've made a Isaac Randomizer type deal where you can input your progress in the game and it will spit out something for you to do. Uh, well, someday I would like to do like a second file where I use that. And I can only like <laughs> do the things it tells me to do. So that should be pretty interesting. Yeah, task generator thing. Password's done. Pog. Let me fix the gamma because it looks ridiculous. Sounds pretty cool. Uh, it looks terrible. Like, I've put zero effort into making it actually look even remotely decent. I haven't shared it, but I guess if some people want want it, I can probably put up a, like a download thing. Could show it sometime. Maybe I can show it right now, actually. I don't know. And it, it'll, it'll give you, like, logical things to do. So if you have... It depends on what you have, like, set as you, what you have unlocked. So you can set it to have, like, not hush killed. And then it'll say, like, go to hush as a random option. But then once you have hush killed, it won't say go to hush. It will say go delirium instead. Unless you've done delirium but not hush, in which case it will say go hush. Well, it won't ever say go hush until you've done uh, Mega Stan, Lamb, and B Blue Baby. Because it will assume that you will get that done during that. Basically, there's an algorithm that does things. I don't know if I've ever said I've made that before. I probably have said that, like, ages ago. Again, though, it, it looks... terrible. <laughs> Zero effort put into the visuals of it. I made this. Oh, I just realized I swallowed the sigil of Baphomet, so I should try to find a new trinket. Whoa, okay. Does it look like a TXT file? It's basically just a black background and like a quadrillion bud buttons for like every completion mark in the game. And just like Ariel as a text. It includes the challenges as well. But you'll have to input your progress manually. It won't like the text from you so far. Because that's I don't know how to do that. Best part, I made that in Game Maker. <laughs> Ragnar's che cheating. <laughs> and I want a game. <laughs> With no context. I mean, true, yeah. Right, I should have used this. Bible Trank is pretty good. I think I would rather have that than this. Help. Ace of Diamonds is good. 
Moon card. Devil card. Uh, we're not making hutch. Where's he? So he's like really far away. Probably to like top right of me right now. Yeah. He saw a rhyme. <laughs> These ice ace of diamonds on some tricky room. Like this one. Okay, that's pretty funny actually. Okay. Dingleberry's alright, I think. It like spawns a friendly dip whenever you clear a room, I think. I, th I think I'd rather have Bible Tract. I'm not gonna mess around with this room. Actually, they're being pulled by the thing. You know what? I'm out. Maybe there's 50 guppy items there. But... Let's see if I care. <laughs> Dude, fuck this card womb enemies. <laughs> Blasting cap is alright, but Bible track better. See, there's Bible tracks. Bible tracks gives you more eternal host, by the way. It does not do anything with angel rooms. Little Baphomets plus mom's uh, box, pretty good. Oh. Should probably do that, but I don't know. If I had flying, I would. Maybe I'll become the lost and then do it. I guess I grab the golden heart on the way back then. So I'm pretty likely to get a double deal here. So I become the lost anyway. I could get like 50 trinkets here. But also like CBA. No devil deal. Um, I don't love becoming the lost in this room because of those rocks that might kill me. Just don't run over them. We're going down as well. for these rocks and we're going down 
Fuck. That's another completion mark. Lined up in a row. This room, though. What, what, what are you doing here, Raph? Um, this is a little scary. I've got Leo, actually, this is fine. That <laughs> dodge. I'm not even mad, that was impressive. So I feel like Satan's gonna be a pain in the ass with this guy chasing us, huh? Thank you, Sigil Baphomet. Um, death trinkets? Eh. I might be able to get another eternal heart. Couldn't see you though, this thing. Alright, Steven, town. He saw hate Steven. Ice cube? Hold on, isn't that one isn't that one really good? Just checking exactly what it is. Oh okay, it's the petrification small chance when entering a room enemies were petrified for four seconds. And it says small chance, so whatever. Oh god. Fuck this. Thank you, Sigil. Ooh. Okay, I gotta take that. Locus the war. This isn't the Gungeon. It's only spawning one Warfly. I think. Yeah, it seems like it's only spawning one. Maybe I can look for a better one. Locust of War is definitely up there in terms of like best trinkets. Apparently I'm exploring this whole floor. Hate this room. Oh, didn't even see that tinge rock. Yikes! Still don't have flying. I keep thinking I have flying for some reason. Ah, uh, sure, I'll use a magician in this room.
Good. Place the bomb just in time for him to get hit by it. Okay, that Satan fight went way better than I had than I expected it to. Oh, another completion mark. Wow, these items though. Um, I think I'm gonna wait for now. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take, uh, if I r run low on HP, I'll, like, sacrifice empty containers. A dark one in a big room is such a pain. I want both brims Brimstone and uh, Twisted Pair for sure. I don't know which one's better. Oh, I swallowed the other thing as well. This is a per, uh, temporary HP up. And that gave me two. Nice. Because of uh, Mom's box. I'd love some way to get into Mega Stan as well. Probably not gonna get it. Oh god, this room is horrible. They made the this ver version of Monster 2 like super fast. And this is like one of the hardest rooms in the game. I do have stopwatch though, so it's not too bad. If you don't have stopwatch here, this room is actually like really tough. Yeah, the flies are not nice for the sigil. I feel like sigil has just carried this run. That's what sigil does. Ow. Don't throw it now, though. It ain't over until it's over. this character. I feel like I have a good shot in Delirium on this run as well. A lot faster with Twisted Pair. Yeah. I wonder if Twisted Pair would increase or decrease my chances against Delirium. Probably increase. I don't think I can take both Brimstone and Twisted Pair. Ow. If I want to do... I don't know which one's better. I want to say Brimstone, but I also want to say Twisted Pair, so I don't fucking... Yeah, I mean, Delirium is just a glorified DPS race. That's what the boss is. Oh god, this room is horrible. I took damage or something?
Okay, that one's well. Brim the Lumber Coal, true. And there's also a legal worm over there if I swallow my current trinkets. Oops. I think I probably take Brimstone if I get Delirium. Let's go back for some HP. It's not, it's not a great chance of getting the thing here, though. Delirium portal. It's like 20%. 20% lamp, lamb. Yeah, I think it's around that. So you're saying there's a chance. a little dangerous. Um, excuse me. Anyone else find this boss, like, weird? If we don't get the other email, I'll try and search for a, a way to get into Mega Stan. No, no. Yeah, no delirium. No surprise. Could try and search for a way. <laughs> Those portals, though. What the fuck? Sun guard. I'll admit, these Tainted Jacob runs have definitely gone better than expected. You know what? G give me the shit. Give me that. Oh, good. Everyone's favorite room. Okay. That was good. Alright. Easy. Yeah, we're not getting there. That's fine. Give me that. Try and search for a secret room. Might as well try for this. It's a very low chance this will actually work, but you know. I'm gonna run out of bombs. There it is. Uh, what could you give? I kind of want to die to Esau just because it'd be funny. You can give demon hearts? What? Alright. That's good intel. 
Uh, yeah, I don't think we're getting in there. I don't know what the pill could have. You know what? Go ahead. <laughs> Alright. Right, there's no unlock for that. <laughs> I was like, where, where's my unlock though? There you go. Wow. Four completion marks that run. I feel like this is going better than it has any right to be. <laughs> 